positive end open y and control this is called y it is open already control this is ecg we have to keep it to lead always close that one occlude y and confirm this one is y this one occlude here huh? confirm Select the vaporizer. This is called vaporizer. We have only right vaporizer. Confirm it. Turn on the right vaporizer and confirm. Turn on. Turn on the right vaporizer and confirm. Confirm. This is capnog gap. We should all ventilators should have capnog gap. This should be connected here. Hmm? You see, turn adjust to nitrous flow higher than six. Here it is written air, nitrous, oxygen. If nitrous is higher than six, is when we will open nitrous, it will be oxygen will be open together. It means nitrous cannot give to the patient alone, always without the support of oxygen. It is written here, turn off oxygen flow, turn off. Only this machine has air support because the other machines we are not using air. Adjust air flow higher than 3. Turn off air flow. Set back. When switch to bag, this is in the bag now. Set APL valve halfway between 30 and 7. This is APL valve between 30 and 70. It's written 30 and 70. Confirm. You see? It will make the bag big and check if the bag is having any leak or not. Coming here, open wide, open wide, and confirm. Confirm. You see, this is coming the finishing because we check everything. Only we don't have vaporizer left. That's why it is coming like that. All green should be here. Start case. It's already an adult patient. Start case. using pressure control volume we start that one uh, usually he is giving 14 and 13 like that for adult patient if this one we will manage according to the weight of the patient once the patient is intubated only we should not set that one because we don't know maybe sometimes it will give more pressure or less pressure always the right should be told for adult huh? And P max, he wants to put it on 25. If the P max, it will be high, it will give, we are giving too much volume to the patient. We cannot give too volume, more than the weight of the patient, it will have problem in the chest. That's why, according to the weight of the patient, we have to 6. But P max should be always 25 for Dr. Renard. After this one, this is the capnograph hole. We have to connect this one here. Before we are connecting with another one, but now we started to use this one. This will, this will control any infection from the patient to one patient to another patient also because we are removing this one every day, every time after that. This is called the catheter mount. We don't have this one too much, that's why. And we sterilizing this one. After this one, the 
it should be here and the support connect everything well you can put it here once the machine is ready okay machine is functioning you can start to put another things 